In June, it looks like uh, most of the automakers are shooting over expectations. So I think that's good. I mean, there are five weekends this month that equates to a lot of auto sales. So it seems to me that there's not just one automaker that's doing well. It just seems that the industry overall has really been lifted from what we expected. The Fiat 500 is done you know, relatively well for the brand. I mean, it is a small vehicle, the only small vehicle within the Chrysler lineup of you know, Chrysler, Dodge, and Jeep. Um, I think it is a bit too small for most people's purchases, but you know, the pricing is pretty good. It's definitely quirky. It has a lot of style. So I think it does attract some consumers. I think it'll still always be a, a, you know, a niche vehicle, though I don't think it's you know, quite big enough to be mainstream, something like you know, a, a Chevy Cruze or a Honda Civic. Well, what happened with the vault that really gave it a sales push was that California has allowed it to go into the carpool lane, and that's big. I mean, everyone knows about the traffic in big cities like Los Angeles, Silicon Valley, San Francisco. So the fact that the vault uh, can travel in those high occupancy vehicle lanes is really important because there's not a lot of vehicles that can do it at this point. So I think that was really a big push, especially since California is, is the big driver of hybrid electric vehicle sales.